guys welcome back to my channel um so i'm going to do a client tutorial today i actually stopped taking clients um but she is a friend of mine and it's her gender reveal today so i had the honor of doing her makeup today so i am taking this shade well first i already primed her eyes with p louise base that's first and foremost and now I'm taking this shade from the James Charles palette. This brush is a brush from Amazon. I don't remember the, I think it's called Do Color or Joe Color. One of those brushes, brush sets, but I'm taking this shade from the James Charles palette and I'm patting it basically into her crease. For the next shade, I take this shade from the James Charles palette on a Morphe M514, tapping, you know, lightly sweeping it across the edges of the first shade. For the last shade going in her crease, we're going to take this shade here from the Warrior palette from Juvia's Place on a Morphe M433, and we're going to concentrate that right into her crease, right where we're going to cut it, basically. For this, I use a paintbrush, but you can use an eyeshadow brush or a concealer brush. I take the P. Louise base on sanitized hands, please don't worry, um, and I pat this shade on her eyes. I'm not going to cut the crease, this is more just like a base before I put the nude shade onto her lid. And you can see, I, as I do it, I kind of swipe down because I don't want to pat the product up. I kind of, I want it to be blended downward. You, you guys see what I'm saying. <laughs> And for the nude shade on her lid, I'm going back in the Warrior palette, taking that shade there on a fluffy eyeshadow brush, and I'm just going to tap that on top of where I applied the base. This next step is optional, but I felt like the edges kind of needed to be blended out more. So going back in with that Morphe M413 and the first brush, I'm just going to, you know, quickly swipe it through the crease. And then taking my NYX liquid liner, I'm going to give her a wing and then pop on some lashes. The lashes I'm going to be using is Angelix Lashes in the Style Baby Girl. Link will be down below. For skin prep, I'm going to moisturize her face with the First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Cream and prime her skin with the Benefit Professional Hydrate. For foundation, I took the ABH foundation in 500C and the NARS Natural Radiant Foundation in Nambia. Mix those together and I'm lightly adding the layer because it was it was hot. It was like 86 degrees this day. I didn't want to layer on the makeup so I just applied it basically where she needed it and then went with the rest of the product for coverage. Thank you. 
For concealer, taking the Too Faced Better Born This Way <laughs> concealer in spiced rum and chai. I'm gonna apply that. Before I blend it out, I'm gonna take my Evian spray and spray her face, keep her moisturized, you know? And I'm gonna take the Real Techniques setting brush to blend out her concealer. And for contour, I'm taking Black Opal Foundation Sticks and Ebony Brown, lightly contouring my face. Again, trying to use minimal products because it's hot out here. Taking this buffing brush from a Real Technique set, I'm gonna buff out her cream contour. Now setting her face with an Instapot brush and my Black Radiance Pressed Powder in Cafe. So I'm gonna bake her face with the ABH uh, Loose Powder in Deep Peach. To warm up her face, I'm going in with ABH bronzer in mahogany on a Morphe, I don't remember the number, I'll put it on the screen. And to get rid of that loose powder, I'm gonna go in with the same brush that I used for her foundation and push it into her skin. So I'm actually went in and baked her face again because it was literally that hot. And that is why I moisturized her face and primed her face with a super hydrating primer so all this baking doesn't really dry out her skin. And of course, going back in with the same brush again to push that powder into her skin.
And for blusher, I'm going in with this shade again from the James Charles palette on a Sonia Kushik blush brush. Guys, I love this brush for blush. I love this color for blush, like all time fave for both. Going back in with this Evian spray to refresh her face once more before I go in with highlight. And for highlight, I'm gonna take ABH Glow Kit, Sugar Glow Kit in Butterscotch. And the lip combo I used today was ABH Lip Gloss in Toffee with KKW Nude 3 Lip Liner. And for the last bit under the eyes, I go in with that shade from the James Charles palette and smudge it under there. Then going in with the Smashbox setting spray to set her face. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope to see you guys in the next one. All products used will be in the description box down below. And let me know what you guys want to see next. Bye.